What's up, guys? Yes, we're back and we're ready to hit the road. Waiting for Coral. One hour later. Okay, we're gonna pick Coral up. and we're going to a restaurant because we're going to review restaurants as we already said in videos and um, Instagram. Instagram it's cold and we're going to go outside to a Italian place we're starting off the Italian places because we like Italian food so yes and we'll let you know <laughs> The side of the tomato with the artichoke and the mozzarella, and as well as the We have a couple of things to say about the restaurant. What we're gonna rate her? I'm gonna rate her a five out of five. Out of five. What? Me. Oh, yourself. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna start <laughs> off with the service. What would you rate it? Stars from one to five. Stars from one to five. Service. Yes. Four. Why? He didn't talk to us. All he asked us was, uh, what did he ask us? Is everything alright? Yeah. So I would say asked. four as well because he wasn't very engaging with anyone in the restaurant. It's like he was having a bad day and didn't want to talk to anybody. Yeah. But, but still, he wasn't rude, no. so I would give four because exactly. it was alright. Everybody has a bad day. Next is the food. Okay, what about the antipasto? What would that you rate it? That's very good. Yeah. Five. I would rate it four because, because of, the, of bread. the bread. I know, yes, it is so many times, but that <laughs> bread. Like the fifth time, sixth, <laughs> seventh, million 
I know, but the bread has to be good. And that wasn't that good. Then pizza. Pizza, I liked it, but doesn't remind me of Italy at all. Nope. I would say three and a half. Yeah. I would say three. Three? I really want to, should have tried the margarita though. Because I feel like when I try the margarita, I can really compare it. But yeah. with the one that I had, I couldn't really compare it so much. I just could compare, like the way it looked was very English. Like in mm -hmm. Italy, if it was spinach, they would literally like just throw it on top. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but here, they like break it up and like divide it into the little pieces. Yeah, they're trying to make it look nice rather than tasty. Yeah. I think the main thing which we both agreed on it was the fact that the pizza itself it looked like plasticky like well, it stayed Well, I didn't say it looked like plastic. Well, to me it looked like plastic because it stayed the same the whole time. It did not move at all. Like it came out to us hot but Fresh. it was like that. Crispy. Did not move. It was very crunchy. It's not like the Roman pizza where it's like like how I already said. And so the whole restaurant, what do we rate it? Good. <laughs> we moved from stars to good. I would say three. Three. And a half maybe. Yeah. It wasn't bad. Yeah, no. Three and a half. We're just saying compared but, to Italy. Yeah, if we're comparing it to Italy, three, three is fine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. But that's take one done of our Italian experience in England. Yep. So I think this is the first Italian restaurant that we've been to in England yep. ever. We're gonna go to try them all. Yeah, we're gonna try them all, but we're not gonna try the chain ones because we yeah. know they're gonna be terrible and we literally don't care about them. And I have already, and I worked as a deliverer, so I already see how they are and they look disgusting, so I wouldn't yeah. even try them. Hope you've enjoyed watching our video. Don't forget to subscribe and join us in on all of our other videos that we have for you here. And join us on Instagram. <laughs> And Facebook and like and share with your friends. And don't try this at home. No. Bye. Bye. Bye.